Hello, and welcome to Media Solutions MS Test Pro demo. I'm going to demonstrate how to test the sensitivity of the HD Base T. MS Test Pro is the only handheld solution for in field testing of HD Base T systems and cabling. In this demo, we will transmit 4K and 1080p video resolution through the HD Base T links and compare between them. The setup includes a connection between the MST Pro HDMI pattern generator to the source device, connecting it to the sync through the HD Base T device, and transmitting the video to the display. Let's start by examining the overall performance of the system. We see that the general link quality is very good. We see that it is connected via a Class A device and that the speed through the HD Base T is 148 megapixel clock, which means this is 1080p 60Hz resolution. Checking it with the HDMI generator, we can see that the resolution through the system is the same and matches 1080p 60Hz. Now, on the right side, we will review the performance of the system on the LCD, including the max error rate. On the upper part, we can see the quality of the HD Base T transmission through each of the category cable pairs. We can see a gap between the transmission bars and the upper yellow and red line. This gap is transmission overhead. And it means that noise, which may interfere with the transmission on the category cables, cannot fail the system, lose pixels, or cause other errors. We are now going to examine the same behavior with 4K video resolution. I am now changing the HDMI generator setup to 4KP, 30Hz, and click Start which immediately transmit this. On the right side, we can see the signal lost the overhead. And the pairs are close to the threshold lines. As soon as they pass the threshold, we can expect errors or even video frames drops. This can sometimes cause link reset on the HD Base T system. MS Test Pro, the only handheld solution for in field testing of HD Base T systems and cabling. Installers can immediately detect line sensitivity and reduce any installation time, especially 4K installations, while increasing signal-to-noise ratio (SNR). 